Okay, let's proceed to the social learning theory. Now, according to Bandura, no, Albert Bandura, according to him, uh, people learn new information and behaviors by watching other people. In other words, as we watch our teachers, as we watch our parents, we learn how to cook, we learn how to teach, no? We, we copy, maybe we imitate no? what they do. So, this is also known as observational learning or modeling. No? So, this type of learning can be used to explain a wide variety of behaviors. Okay, what are the basic concepts of social learning theory? One, the idea that people can learn through observation. So, that stands for O. The idea that internal mental states are an essential part of this process. This theory recognizes that just because something has been learned, it does not mean that it will result in a change in behavior. So, O is observation. Another is imitation. No, it's not, uh, where is that? Imitation. The, the learner observes, the learner imitates, Okay? And the learner models. The learner models. So, through modeling. Yeah, through modeling. So, you imitate. So, what is the application of these two classroom? Be careful, teachers, because your students are observing you. Your students will imitate you. And your students will model you. So, gagawin kanilang model. Ang iba dyan, Pag guwapa guwapa, gid ang teacher nila or guwapo ilang teacher gid na idol idol pa nila, no? They copy, they imitate how the teacher walks, how the teacher uh, uh, dress up, how the teacher talks, no? Okay? So, that's it. So, Bandura Social Learning Theory posits that people learn from one another via observation, imitation, okay, this is what I said, observation, imitation, and modeling. And, uh, in order for uh, modeling to be more effective, ang gagawin ni teacher, ganito, ARMM, no? acronym, ARMM, ano yung ARMM? Attention. Call the attention or get the attention of your learners first. Do not start your teaching if they are have not given their attention yet. So if you are teaching uh, uh, the steps of a dance, so you say, okay, class, watch me. Huh? So attention. A. R. They have to, ano yung R? Recall or ta, kalimutan po. <laughs> ARMM They have to remember or attention okay retention remember or retention no R retention so it, they have to memorize in their mind ano yung paano ginawa ni teacher yung yung sway balance okay paano niya ginawa paano yung kamay pa ganun pa papasok or pa, pa palabas okay then, that's retention. Remembering what, what you paid attention to. Includes symbolic coding, mental images, cognitive organization, symbolic rehearsal, motor rehearsal. No? Ang iba sa inyo magkopya, ang iba sa inyo. Ngayon, mahilig kayo picture-picture na lang. Okay. Now, the next is ARMM, motor reproduction. Motor reproduction. Okay, may motor pa yan, ha? Motor reproduction. You have to reproduce. The image, including physical capabilities and self-observation and reproduction. In other words, kopyahon mo. So, paano yung pagsayaw ni teacher? Oh, step, brush, step, brush, oh, ganon. So, i-imitate mo gina siya. And then, the last is M, motivation. So, you imitate. Even if you are already at home, para pasamayin mo giyapon. Tapos, i-imitate mo, mag-practice ka, no? Para ma-kuha uh, mo talaga. So, maybe some of you are now practicing uh, your uh, demonstration teaching before the mirror. So, nag-practice ka na, no? Okay. So, that's it.